Hey everyone, welcome to a quick demo of this very strange game called the Tornado, the Tornado Chicken. This is an Endless Runner style game where you're playing as a chicken and you have to dodge a bunch of different obstacles. Um, it's, it's very strange. Let's just jump right into it here. TTCV 1.8 File Explorer. All right, so the game is free and uh, you can get it from itch.io. The Tornado Chicken. Main menu. Play. So here we are in the menu. This is just a standard menu. Uh, you can go down and up with the arrow keys. Page up and page down. We'll turn the music volume. This is up. Page down. We'll turn it down. Test speakers. Let's run a speaker test. That's important. Say B. Left. Right. Main menu. Play. Yep. So, of course, you press. Enter to click on things. Test speak. Learn game sounds. Uh, learn game sounds. I'll go through that in just a second. Configure settings. Exit. You can configure your preferences and then you can quit. Play. And the menu does wrap around. I think I turned that on though. Let me go back here. I configure game settings. Output sound device. Default. You can change where the game's audio is being sent. Play logo on startup. On. I'm going to turn that off. So I'm going to press enter right here. Game setting. Allow menu wrap. Play logo. Allow menu wrapping. On. I do want that on. Use NVDA screen reader when speaking. On. Uh, I turn this on, so it's going to use NVDA instead of the built-in voices in Windows. Now this game is coded in the non-visual gaming toolkit, so it does actually have a built-in voice. Let me show you that real quick. Game settings. Use NVDA screen reader when speaking. Off current voice. You can change your voice here. Change voice. Ivona to Sally OEM. Microsoft David Desktop. English. United States, Microsoft Zira Desktop V underscore American underscore English underscore Ava underscore 22 kilohertz. That's vocalizer Ava. Built-in fallback voice. And this is the built-in voice, which is awful. Game setting current voice, built-in fallback voice. I don't even know what this is supposed to be, but it's awful. Use NVDA screen reader current voice change by VO and Game settings, SAPI voice rate. 10. You, you can change the rate. Sapi voice pitch. 10. Sapi voice volume. Return to main and the volume. menu. volume. Now obviously if you're using it with NVDA, those those preferences are controlled from the reader itself. Say current voice. Use NV game settings. Allow menu. Say, say, return to main menu. Test speak. Learn game sounds. Let's, let's take a quick look at this menu. Game sounds list. Press enter to play a sound. A normal plan. These are uh, plants that will heal you and speed you, or actually no, I don't think they heal you, but they do make you move quicker. A toxic plant. These are bad. You want to jump past these. Uh, if you take them, they will s slow you down and take away health. A healing plant. So you can press... Uh, eh, eh, eh. Enter here and you can play these and you can actually press the key as quickly as you would like. Whoa, what was that? Okay, I guess that was a car. The prawn shield. This is a shield. It will, uh, I believe it will convert uh, flying f frisbees into healing plants and regular plants. A pit that you must jump over. That's just a, a pit. A wooden wall. That is supposed to be a wall. The sound for that needs to be changed. It sounds like a mechanical machine. That is not a wooden wall. But uh, when you hit those, your character will stop and you'll have to hit the space bar re repeatedly to peck your way through it. Yes, this game is quite strange. Flying Frisbee. Uh, you will hear this sound a lot. These will come from the left or the right side. 
and you'll have to press the letter F to to hit them on the left side or J on the right. If you don't, they'll hit you and hurt you. Laughing kid. Uh, these will grab you and walk around with you. I don't think they actually hurt you, but they will stop you from being able to move around by yourself. And you have to, you have to hit the right and left control keys a few times to escape them. Yeah, it's a little odd. Small cars. That is supposed to be a car. You're supposed to jump over those. I don't like that sound. Moving slides. <laughs> That's a slide thing that will pick you up and transport you for a while. If you jump when it's close to you, otherwise it will hit you and the game will end. The motor bird. I don't know what this is supposed to be. This is supposed to be some other kind of trap. <laughs> That is a very strange sound. Again, you have to jump onto those and they'll transport you for quite some time. A normal plan. Main menu. Test speakers. Play. Um, I do recommend reading the documentation that comes with this, but I'm going to go ahead and play this now. The controls are pretty easy. I told you a few of them. Um, right and left arrow keys will turn you but your character is always moving, and the longer you play, uh, the quicker you move. So let's go ahead and uh, play this. Oh, and uh, pressing F10 during playback will pause the game. So here we are just uh, playing here. There's a frisbee to my left, and hit J. And then that was, or no, pressing, yeah, so J is the right, like that and F is the left, like this. If I press F9, pause menu, resume game. The game is paused. Return to the main menu, resume game. You can press page up and page down to change the music. The music in this game is pretty cool, I, I have to say. Return to the main menu, resume game. I want to get hit. Oh. Uh, pressing H 148 will tell you your health. It's a car. Let's jump over that. Pop up here. Whoa. Now. Uh. That was a slide. Play stats and scores. A moving slide crashed against you. And here's the music that plays when you lose or when the game is over. You ran a distance of 151 feet and traveled by air three times. You jumped over zero pits and two cars. You blocked 15 flying discs and four managed to hit you. You managed to find zero prawn shields and peck zero walls. Zero kids picked you up, zero slides captured you, and you rode zero motor birds. You picked up zero speed increasing plants and zero speed decreasing plants. You picked up zero healing plants and zero toxic plants. A moving slide crap. Main menu. Test and I believe you can hit escape or enter and that will take you back to the menu. So let's actually Play. try playing this. I'm going to see how long I can go this time. There's a frisbee on my left. And my reflexes suck. There we go. <laughs> One hundred twenty-two. One hundred. So I'm gonna jump. Now it's carrying me, and the those are the frisbees hitting this thing that's transporting me. I told you this game was very strange. And the slide. Okay, that beep is supposedly lightning. If you jump, it will clear things out of the field. And that was a slide thing that picked me up. This game is very fast paced.
Jump left past that and then go back to the right. I don't think it really matters which way you travel. It's a wall. I'm going to hit the space bar to get past that. Jump when I hear the beep, which clears out the area. I'm not doing too well. Jump over the pit. You press the up arrow to jump. Jump. Forty-seven. I'm not. I am not doing too good. Huh? Forty-seven. I can get past. Forty one gets rid of the wall. Thirty nine. Let's walk away from that. Yeah, Thirty five. I don't want to get hit by that. Twenty eight. Oh, crap. Problem with this game is it gets really fast. Jump. Jump with the up arrow. There we go. And get rid of that. Twenty. Now that's a shield that's off to my left, but I may not be able to get to it. Nope, I'm taking you past it. Come on. Oh. 17. 14. Run pa Jump past that kid. 12. I just get hit by the gameplay stats and scores. A moving slide crashed against you. All right here we are. We got this nice music here. You ran a distance of 649 feet and traveled by air 34 times. You jumped over two pits and five cars. You blocked 52 flying discs and 50 managed to hit you. You managed to find zero prawn shields and pecked one walls. Zero kids picked you up, three slides captured you, and you rode four motor birds. You picked up one speed increasing plants and zero speed decreasing plants. You picked up one healing plants and one toxic plants. Whoops, I picked up a toxic plant. A moving slide crashed against you. And let's press escape. Main menu, test speakers. And escape TTC. again to close the program. Audacity. Uh, so that's the game. It's, it's a weird little time waster. It is free. Of course, I'll put the link to the uh, game in the description. Now, the, I'm using version 1.8. You can still download version 1.5 from that same page, but 1.8 has some bug fixes. And new versions can also be found on that page, so you should check back regularly. Um, anyway, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this. And until next time, take care.